In the heart of Zambia, the Engineering Institution of Zambia is diligently working to promote and regulate the engineering profession. Established by the Engineering Institution of Zambia Act No. 17 of 2010, the Engineering Institution of Zambia is a statutory professional regulatory body, ensuring that engineers and technicians are fully licensed. With over 8,000 registered companies and more than 44,000 individuals, the Engineering Institution of Zambia is the foundation that supports the engineering community in Zambia. In 2014, the Engineering Institution of Zambia established the Engineering Institution of Zambia Benevolent Fund. The fund was created with one objective in mind. In 2015, um, the EIZ Benevolent Fund was born and uh, registered with the registrar of uh, companies. And uh, the first board was uh, installed, uh, which immediately began to look at um, how the fund was going to be operationalized. So um, they did put in place um, the constitution of the fund that uh, could help them uh, govern um, the, the fund. They also put up a strategic plan that um, would also see the, the, the board manage the fund for, um, inter, intermittently for two years and uh, also put uh, the guidelines for needs assessment and also the application forms. The fund was created with one objective in mind to provide financial relief to registered members, both current and past. Zina Ranga and John Soko, and a full paid member of EIZ. Business young, I have a metal fabricator, and I am from 2016. I have a lot of people who are going to be able to do this. I have a lot of challenges in 2020 when I have a coronavirus. Business is going to be able to do this. So after number that if I actually if I a full member of EIZ, uh I apply on the application in the disease put financial support. So from there Nabana Remba application, Nimovan and Zilava EIZ. So what exactly is the, the Engineering Institution of Zambia Benevolent Fund? The Benevolent Fund was set up to provide practical and financial support for all members who are in need. This may be due to an illness, an accident, or simply to expand your business. So for members who wish to apply for benevolence, you can send your application to the Registrar or Chief Executive Officer of the Engineering Institution of Zambia and your application will be considered. So all members that are fully paid up are welcome to apply for benevolence. But how does one become eligible for the, the Engineering Institution of Zambia Benevolent Fund? So the Benevolent Fund, if anyone, as long as you are a paid up member, you are eligible uh, person to apply for, for funding, for possible funding. So these are craftspeople, technicians, technologists, fellows and engineers as a, as, as, as a whole. So um, what is the process like? The process is simple. All you have to do is just go to our website or get in touch with Secretariat, whichever will be easier for you, our members, and you can access the application form. And once you fill in the application, the board will sit to just review or for, for possible consideration. And once you qualify, you will actually benefit uh, uh, part of the fund. Recently, the Engineering Institution of Zambia offered a helping hand to two deserving members who applied for the fund. Checks were issued and presented to them at a special ceremony held right here at the Engineering Institution of Zambia office. Thanks very much to Engineering Institute of Zambia. They came to our aid when we were in need. We had a problem when we were under COVID, we were learning a business. So when we saw that we could not manage, we applied to Engineering Institute of Zambia. Then afterwards, they sent a committee to our place to come and interview us. That's how we came up to have this grant. We see that the people who benefit really from this, these are fully up members who do benefit. And we do appreciate to all the management and all the entourage who visited us, thanks very much. May this spirit continue. 
I would like to thank EIZ for this good gesture. I came to know about it through a colleague of mine who I was working with. And uh, I applied when I failed to continue working. And uh, within a short time, the EIZ responded to my application and uh, they awarded me with a 20,000 kwacha. And uh, this will go a long way in alleviating my suffering and I uh, hope to put it to good use. And I'm encouraging all those that are not members of EIZ to join EIZ and be fully paid up members to benefit from this fund. This heartwarming ceremony not only showcased the compassion and dedication of the engineering institution of Zambia team, but also highlighted the importance of this fund in our engineering community. At the Engineering Institution of Zambia, we believe in supporting our members, both present and past. The Engineering Institution of Zambia Benevolent Fund is just one way we demonstrate our commitment to the engineering profession. To learn more about the Engineering Institution of Zambia Benevolent Fund and how you can support this noble cause, visit our website or contact us today. The Engineering Institution of Zambia, empowering engineering professionals.